Hi, it's Kim, the Hyper Dufa Gardener, and what's happening in Ohio today? The usual. It's raining, raining. I know that's good for the garden, but sometimes you just want to get out there. But what we're going to do today is catch up on some of my previous projects and let you know how they're going along. And we'll see some before and after pictures, and you tell me what you think. And be sure to check out the post on my blog. Remember my little baby succulent farm where we put tiny little cuttings to see how they could develop? Look what happened. Here is my update on my little uh, succulent farm. I would have to check the dates, but it's probably been about a month. But you can see the growth on these things. Look at how much taller everyone has extended to. We've really got a lot of growth. Let me see if I can focus a little better. You can see how many roots have grown out of that. A lot of growth. They have grown an inch some of them three inches. We really have a lot. Now that's some of the little elephant jade, elephant bush, mini jade, the sexangular. Look at all the amounts that have grown up in there. So we have a nice crop from that sedum top. Now this right here is the um, rosemary. Rosemary, I assume, does not propagate that way. Maybe it was a little too dry for it, but the rosemary just rolled over and died. But the rest of everything has gone gangbusters. Look at that. That's that tile. And I may splice in one of the originals to show you the difference. But look at that. That has grown so much. So, so much. Dead Lavender Field. I mean, sorry, Rosemary. But the rest of it, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. My rock garden on the hill was really pathetic looking when we first came with all the landscape fabric exposed, but that has transformed. We'll see what we can do to make a nice full side runoff. Look how well this boulder area is doing. Not look good. It's turned out so nice. Any little new plants very, very soon. I think I'll have three little new plants very, very soon. Now, if you remember the little cuttings we did with my baby sun rose, you can see how much growth we have. This one has really popped up. And we're even, even starting blooming. So those were definitely a success. Am I going to focus on that? There it is. Just the bud going to begin to open. And the others, very much taller. Let me get down so you can see the growth amount. 
look how nice those are. They've really done well. And no bigger than they are, at least the one has started to bloom. Because it's success. And finally, I have the Swedish Ivy cutting that I put in water from my large plant here in the house. And I found a pretty little blue bowl dish to put it in. Found that at the thrift store for 99 cents. I think it sets off that green wonderfully. But you can see how nice this has rooted. I have it now in the soil and it's taking off quite well, even sending out new branches. But thanks for watching today and be sure to stay tuned and I'll catch up on more projects later on. Thanks for watching.